Three people are dead after a deadly single vehicle crash in Dale County. The tragedy happened on Friday night and the victims were later identified. Tonight, WDHN's Robert Smith Jr. spoke to the family of the victims in the crash who are speaking out and reflecting on the life of their loved ones only on WDHN. It's been a gut riching weekend for family of Jeffrey Little, Emma Welch and Nicholas Gordon as they lost their loved ones in a three person crash in Dale County Friday night. It's a bad, bad dream that is now reality. I don't sleep right now, but I know I eventually it'll get better. Um, but it's just been very hard trying to take this in. It's been extremely difficult. I think for me, it makes it even diff even more difficult that there were others involved. Welch and Little were passengers of Nicholas Gordon, who was driving a 2005 yellow Mustang that left the road and hit a tree in the 500 block of County Road 67 in Millen City near Echo, a few minutes from Gordon and Little's house. Yesterday, I left there at like 8 o'clock at night from talking to everybody. Um, but everybody there, all his friends and stuff, said that that's where they were going, to a truck meet. Little had just talked to his father about four minutes before about going to Louisville to help them get situated in their new home. He was here at the at the new house, and, and, and I said, have you talked to Jeffrey? And he said, um, yeah, I, I talked to him a little while ago. Why? And I said, well, there's been an accident. Uh, and it's posted on Facebook, and... Oh, there, there's fatalities and it's on County Road 67. Um, and he said, please don't say that because I just looked at his location and his last location was County Road 67. According to the state troopers office, none of them were wearing seatbelts at the time of the crash. Welch's parents believe they were speeding. All we know is they lost control. It was raining and hit a tree and none of them were wearing seatbelts. I'm looking at the car, seat belts, what the hell. Out of the outpouring of love, a makeshift memorial has been placed at the crash site in memory of Welch and Little. My baby was very smart, very bright, outgoing, loved everybody, everything. As for Little, his stepmother says he was very loving and helpful. He even helped the community often by serving as a volunteer firefighter with Louisville and Green Cross Rose Fire Departments. Everybody was his friend. He wanted he wanted to make sure that everybody was included and and felt loved and appreciated. Gordon was also a helper to his friends, a kind hearted person who loved to go fishing and loved his family. I mean, it's tearing everybody up that he's not going to be with us anymore. Reporting Robert Smith, WDHN News for The Wiregrass.